So today in this video, I'm going to share some tips. Tics. Hey guys, I'm Dwani and you're watching Bloggers Up. Welcome back to my channel. So today in this video, I'll be sharing my tips and tricks which I use to draw a sketch. And if you are a beginner, then this will be very helpful for you while you draw a sketch. So without any further ado, let's begin the video. And don't forget to subscribe my channel, hit the bell icon so that you can notify when I'm on YouTube. And also like my videos and share my videos. Also comment down how much would you rate my sketch out of 10. So the supplies which we are going to use are a drawing book or any kind of sketchbook which you use, different shades of pencils, basically HP pencils to help you give lighter and the darker tones in the sketch, some blending tools like cotton birds and a tissue paper. First I'm drawing a rectangular box in which I'll draw the sketch. This is a totally optional step, you can also skip this one. If you are a beginner in sketching like me, then you should find a good reference image so that you can focus on the parts which should be in a particular shape and you can find more better ways to how to draw it better. Don't start drawing your sketch exactly as per the reference image from the beginning. Instead, you can just draw a basic outline with a lighter pencil just like I'm doing here with the basic shapes. If I'm drawing a human figure then I have the basic shapes like eyebrows, nose, lips and eyes. And then you can start shading your sketch as per your reference image. While drawing the lips I was not feeling convenient to draw the lips with this method and also I was not satisfied with the shape of the lips. So I just use the method which I use more often. Here I'm just drawing the basic outline of the braids so that when I start giving texture to the hair, it gets more convenient and easy for me to give texture to the hair and it looks more beautiful. After giving shade to the lips, I realized that because of the lips, my whole sketch was not going well and was looking really bad. So I just had to erase the lips and draw it again. The best blending tool for me is a small piece of tissue paper. You can just hold it below your finger and just rub the area where you want to shade and it will just give a beautiful shade out there. If you want to spread the same shade of the pencil to every part then you can use a cotton board for that. After sketching and giving shade to the basic facial structure, I just started giving shade to the cheeks, forehead and below the neck and drew the t-shirt. And yes, now my sketch is completely ready. If you just write your name below any of the drawings you do, then here's a small trick. You can take any transparent sheet and write your name on it and then just move it around your drawing and just check whether it's looking fine in there and if you find the spot, then do it. 